Okay, let's continue then. So, uh, let's make a to-do list. That's why I picked this up, actually. So, here's what we need. We shall write a notebook. So, this is the Brook Walker to-do list. Exclamation mark, exclamation mark, uh, fish, smiley face. Sure. Uh, right, so, first things first. Find shelter. Shel shelter, sure. Fi you know what? We, well, why am I even putting that in there? Because we don't even need it. We need to heal leg. That is very important. Currently... That is not done. In fact, I'll leave that blank there. So we need to heal leg. Second, we need to, if we can, find a lighter because we need to smoke. Fight? <laughs> fight a light. <laughs> fight a lighter. Uh, find matches slash lighter. That is going to be very important. We, need, we haven't found that yet. Uh, we need food, which is going to be ongoing, really. Uh, if I can, seeds would be nice. I want to be able to grow my own food. Fishing gear is going to be important, because that will get us a lot of food. Not just, like, low-tier food as well. Like, I could probably dig the ground for some worms to get some food. I need some food that will actually fill me up. Other than that... Um, we'll eventually need to go... Oh yeah, we need to grab guns. Because <laughs> there was a ton of guns back there that I completely left. Uh, that I would like to have at some point. So we need to grab guns. And... What else? Car? <laughs> Car is a very long-term goal. But we'll have it in there. If I can also, uh, we'll have... Books. We will need to find more books. Any skill book. Just any skill books. Okay, that is our to-do list. We shall place it here, and we shall not forget about it. There. Okay, it is 7 o'clock. We are hungry. We are depressed. Uh, could I... Perchance... Uh, reduce the stress, reduce the boredom. Sure, why not? Let's let's take a little bit of time and read one of our few magazines. We are a slow reader, but that's fine. Means we enjoy it more. Okay, we have read a magazine that hasn't done anything for us. So. There is somewhere I want to loot up there. I suppose we can take a look. I was just going to spend the rest of the day forging, but uh, if we, we've still got a bit of daylight, I could probably loot it before the end of the day. So let's give it a look. I am sprinting. I probably shouldn't waste my energy. Not until I know it's safe. So, once again, walk. We just want to go up here, pretty much. And eventually we'll hit a fence. Although we'll get, you'll get this, yeah. So we got this little clearing where there's like power lines. Can we follow either side to civilization? There's going to be a road on either side of this forest. And up here, there will be a little campground. And the campground might have some decent stuff. Mainly tools. So if I follow this, there will be people here though, I imagine. Get a little dark. Hopefully this won't be a bad idea. Right, so, first <laughs> first things first. This is the bathroom. Anyone here? There's absolutely going to be people in this bathroom. Yeah, there we go. How many, though? Two. Okay. Kill the bathroom out. Okay, hoodie, uh, not 
that good. Does a jacket. It's technically better, and I'm also not wearing anything else, so yeah, sure. Let's go with this jacket. It's better condition than the previous jacket we had. Alright, anyone else inside the bathroom? Did anyone zombify inside a bathroom? This is the worst. Oh yes, there is... What are you doing here? It's a men's... I assume it's the men's bathroom. I'm just gonna say it's the men's bathroom. Oh. Charlie, thank you for subscribing. Your 40th month. Welcome. Yo, yes, I am... <laughs> I'm currently fighting the zombie apocalypse with a massive wound inside my groin. Also... Cockroach, amazing. We have food, guys. We have some food. We will not go hungry. Okay, is anyone here? Seriously, I want to clear this out so I can come here in peace. Anyone here? Oh, it's not forbidden. More cockroaches? Yes! Oh my god, we're doing so well. Nope. And... Nope. Nope. No. Okay. I'll just open that last one up so I know. Okay, as far as I'm concerned, this is clear. Okay. On to bathroom number two. <laughs> is anyone here? Come on, don't be shy. No. I'm not attracted to other zombies. I am starving. Did I bring any food? I <laughs> except the cockroaches, of course. I got some salt. That's all I brought with me. There is a like a canteen here, so I might be able to eat out there. I don't want to eat a raw cockroach if I can help it, but I I will if I have to. And there's nothing. Great. Okay, bathroom number two. Clear or shower room, whatever. Is there a cockroach? No, it's only a garbage bag, but I'll take it anyway. I just find any amount of food. Okay, hello? Anyone here? It's like a dinner bell. As a plant. Some more garbage bags. Another garbage bag. Anyone here? I don't think anyone's in there. Okay, let's head inside. I just keep thinking I hear something. Uh, there's a rotten sausage, a rotten strawberry, rotten peas. There was a mug. I will take the mug. A saucepan. Yes. Yes. Some canned food that I can I still can't open. I will find a can opener. I should have I should have added that to my list. God damn it. All right, can opener. That's the other thing I want. Uh. Okay, garbage bag. Okay, six of those. Okay. Quickly. Not starving yet. I should not have just opened that door as I did. Do not follow this as, the, as certain advice. Is there any... No, there's not. There's just a goddamn metal pipe. Right. I will clear that out another time. There's usually nothing much in there. There's just people. Okay, kind of a bust. Didn't get much in the way of food. I'll, I'll come back and I'll eat what I can. I don't... I can't... I, as much as I'm happy to see the cockroaches, unless I can cook them, which I can't, I'm not eating them because it just makes me really depressed. Although I might have to because otherwise I might be eating worms otherwise. Can eat some salt. <laughs> which it makes me... Apparently just eating the salt shaker is about as much unhappiness as eating the cockroach. I mean, yeah, I guess that would be terrible to just eat on its own. Just pouring the salt out on your tongue. Uh, that would be terrible. Uh, right. So yes, follow this back. Here's the fence that we need to take. How's our skills? Sprinting's almost at level 1. So yes, follow our way through. Don't have to worry about zombies, thankfully. Can just we could actually just sprint the rest of the the rest of the way back. Might as well get the skill up if I can. Long blunt's doing well. Maintenance is okay. How's my weapon doing? 
Weapon, it's in really good condition. We were so lucky to find this. We've got a pistol that doesn't have any ammo. I should probably just drop that off. Nobody really carrying it around with me. You know, a pistol with ammo might have been something else, but this is like nothing. I suppose I could always go back for the guns that I found. But it's really not worth it. If anything, I want to go to the farmhouse nearby first. Usually a good place to find some extra food, extra everything. I might even find a can opener. And that would, like, solve a lot of my food problems. You know, I got a can opener. It's called a crowbar. I should put it on the ground, smash open the can, and then just scoop up what's left. I've got a knife as well. I could just knife it. I've got a kitchen knife. You know, there's other methods than just a can opener to open a can. Probably. Right? I'm sure I'm right in saying that. Now my house is... Uh, there it is, okay. Don't want to get lost. Okay. Not a bad day's haul. Got plenty... <laughs> <laughs> we got plenty of cockroaches. We're doing well, guys. We're doing well. And they're all for me. Don't have to share with a single other person. Uh, right. Mug. You know what? This will be like my seeds and water. Sure. It's my food. Put the salt in there. Empty bottle. Is that going to be easier to carry than my other bourbon bottle? Uh, that is seven, and that is eight. Oh, so the bourbon maybe just carries less? I'll leave the bourbon bottle anyway. I'll carry the actual plastic water, uh, water bottle. Okay, uh... <laughs> now what can I eat today? Hmm, I could have some beer. I could have some paste. I could have some ramen. I could have a bullion cube. You know what? Let's let's have the one thing that doesn't make me completely depressed and have something to drink. There we go. One bottle of beer. That'll have to do. Uh, gun. Yeah, we'll leave the gun here. Keep the painkillers. Keep the ripped sheets. Okay, let's end the day. Still no smokes, still no nothing. So we'll clear out the rest of that campground, and then we'll make our way over to the farmhouse. Okay, we're in pain again. Not surprising, we still have this. As long as we're getting pain, I'm not even going to open that wound. Because there is a chance it could heal on its own. It's very unlikely, though. That's why I need to sew it up. Uh, how am I doing? I should take some food with me. What do I have? For, what are my supplies again? I have one bottle of beer. Let's take that. There we go. Thank God for that random campground I came across. Oh, I want a belt as well. I should have... There's so much I forgot to add to my to-do list. Next time. Okay. In the meantime, let's make our way back. So, cross the open field. Yeah, usually there's like maybe some military stuff. Maybe some lumberjack stuff. If I can get some new boots, that would be great. Because currently I'm wearing just, like, shoes. So just up here. Yeah, that, I'm going to be starving for a long time until I can find maybe a can opener. Or get a proper source of food. Now, I could... I could start digging some furrows and plant the carrots. 
But if I can avoid it, I don't want to really, you know, dig holes in the ground with my hands. Because then I'll hurt my hands, and I don't really want to hurt my hands because I need my hands to do other things. No. See, it's mostly empty. It's a lumberjack shirt, probably better than the one we have. Yep. Excellent. Is that a bear? Okay, there's bears around. Lumberjack shirt. Oh, some military camo pants. Uh, they don't do anything for me. I'm wearing padded pants, so it's better. I've got better stuff anyway. And there, there's no cars. God damn it. Okay, if there was cars, that'd be great. But there's no cars. All right, let's go this out. Anyone here? Nope. Uh, there was a hat. Is that better than my hat? It is better than my hat. I will take this hat. Amazing. <laughs> Just throw that on the ground. Uh, nope. There's some desert camo, but that's not going to do me any good. Yeah, the desert camo is going to do me some great stuff in the forest. More military camo. Not doing it for me. There's no zombies. I'm surprised. Usually there's at least one. Seems we're a bit lucky here, which is good. Last room. Is there a zombie in here? Are you gonna make me eat those words? No. Okay. There's a, a fanny pack! Incredible! Great! That is that is actually an amazing find. Right. Uh, let's put our medical supplies in there. It's an extra backpack that we can use. There we go. can even keep my screwdriver. Right. So, campgrounds cleared. We have a car. Oh yeah, I should probably do this. So that's clear, that's clear. That's the wood area. Um, this is home. Where's my home marker? So this is base camp. This is clear. So that's clear, that's clear, that's clear, and that's clear. Okay, there's nothing left here for me to loot. So with that, let's head down the road. There should be a small farmhouse I can loot. Probably with people again. It'll be smaller than the last one. It'll be single story. Up there is probably more farmhouses. So just follow the fence. I will find civilization. I will be out here in the boonies for a long time. There is no way I can go back to the city until I'm fully healed, and maybe a little bit better off than I am. I mean, I'm still starving. If I go there starved and injured, I'm gonna die. I was lucky to escape as I was. I w I'm surprised to die once. I expected to die several times, like I did on my test runs. But I didn't. So that's incredible. Brooke Walker is just clearly made of other fins. She is built differently. Okay, nothing. And a ba two bags of gravel. Okay. Good to know. If I need any gravel, I'll come back here. There is uh, no need for gravel at the current moment. The saw, though, and the trowel. If that's... I'll take all of it. Give, give me all of it. Gib. Okay, that was really, really good. Okay, now I can finally dig so I can start planting my crops. I can also saw fins. So if I can get an axe, or if I can find logs, which I can forge logs for, I can build planks. If I can get nails, I can actually start making stuff. So, hello. There's a generator in here! Oh my god. This is great. Anyone in here? Is that a no? That's a lock. That's a locked door. Okay. Let's try this. Okay. We got a magazine. I will take the magazine. For personal use, of course. A propane torch. That is good to know. I will keep that here with the generator because I can't use the generator anyway. Uh, I've got brown paint. I got a fitness contraption. One of one. Hold on, what is this? 
What is the thickness contraption? Can I put this down? Oh my god! <laughs> oh, I could bring that back with me! Uh, I will leave this here. We do not need a weight set at the moment. But I, I will note that down. Oh, a crowbar! Another crowbar! That's... No, I don't want that in my main inventory. Another screwdriver? Could be useful. Rope? Don't think I'll need rope. Okay, did I hear a zombie outside? No. Okay, good. So, just to quickly note down then. Cleared. Miss. Where's the power mark? Yeah, here. That is a generator. So we have a generator on here. Along with propane. I will come back to that. I don't know how to use a generator yet. But when I do... And I get fuel, which is another problem altogether. I can start using it. That's a really good find, especially out here. I didn't expect to find anything that decent out here. I'm just lucky, I guess. That trade is really paying off, probably. Maybe. I don't know. It's another generator! There's two! Incredible. The propane tank? I could actually start... I could actually start using this. Hand torch. I can see in the dark. I'll take it anyway. Why not? Okay. So, we have a second generator. Amazing. Two. Okay, time to approach the house. Now, again, I'm looking for can openers, lighters, some sort of sewing kit. Or, in general, just food. Because I'm starving. Hello. Hello, family. Is anyone here? The last farmhouse had police called to it, so I'm hoping this one will be less lively. Is anyone here? Hello? Hello? The car's gone, so maybe you're gone as well. The door is open. Well, if you are here, you're extremely careless. Okay, now I'm careless. <laughs> God damn it! Oh, uh, why did I have to say that? Okay, time to go. There's probably, like, no zombies in the nearby area. But if there is, I am not staying here. We shall go home, drop off our loot, give it a little bit. I can start digging holes for my carrots, and I'll come back. Yep, we are out of here. We are out of here. I will come back at a later date. Last thing I want is a horde of zombies coming down upon me. Upon me. <coughs> ah, time to get a drink. Well, if we follow this fence, we should head back. Pretty much, if you want to find where we are, you head to the end of this fence, and then head down, and that's where we are. That's our home. Uh, wait, let's see if we can get the sprinting level up. Got nimble and light-footed. It's slowly coming up. If I can level these up, that would be great. Because I can't really afford to be seen. I need to, I should probably bathe as well. Like, my character's covered in blood. And there's wolves. Got first aid. Uh, maintenance. Yep. Yeah, it's all coming together. It's all coming together. Okay, let's stop sneaking for a while. How am I looking? Oh, that's what I look like. I'm still hobbling. That's fine. Actually, I'm, I move faster when I'm crouched. Yeah, I'm still in pain. If I'm not in pain, that means the wound has closed up. Okay, from here, we head down. And eventually we'll head back to our house. So, we'll have a beer. A nice congratulatory beer for ourselves, I think. And uh, then we'll start planting our carrots. Their house should be... There. Good. Okay, so... 
did I get? I did get another crowbar, which is nice. Put that in here. Uh, more garbage bags, which I can leave. Uh, a rake, which I probably don't need at the moment. Now I trowel, that's what I'm after. Right. Uh, in fact, let's leave the wrench. And the magazine can go in here. Oh, uh, uh, the carrots, right. Carrots. So, we'll have a nice beer, and we'll get to gardening. Let's, uh, do half. Okay, there we go. So, uh, dig furrows. We shall have the farm just here. Now I'll make a few lines, because if I can, I want to get some worms, because they're an emergency food source. No worms yet. That's okay. I can deal, dig some nice furrows. There's also other places I can get seeds. There are some nice places out here for seeds. A lot of farmhouses. There's like a little warehouse storage area. So dig two nice lawn furrows and get the carrots out. We can start our crop growing empire. We shall never need to worry about food again. Was that a worm? Yes! Okay. Our unlimited food source is here. Yes, you can live off worms at least for a while. Uh, right. Open packets. So, 50 carrot seeds. So seeds, carrots. It's, it is the middle of winter. Not the most ideal time for carrots, but, you know, <laughs> we make do with what we can. So, a few rows of carrots. Put the remaining carrot seeds in here. Uh, now, what I want is the massive cooking pot and saucepan. And I will fill this with water and I shall water my garden. Okay, so with that, let's water. So, water to the full thing. I think they'll take like a hundred each. Plant has enough water, okay. Takes like 80. <laughs> I'm just swapping between various cooking implements. Just trying to get this fin watered, right. Yeah, uh, let's get some more. That's how desperate my situation is. I am in the forest trying to grow crops in the middle of winter using a large cooking pot to water it. Still, though, could be worse. Could be far worse. Could have no crops at all. And currently, I'm still living off beer. I haven't I haven't been reduced to insects yet, but that's probably coming, the, coming my way. Okay, so up to the water bottle. Rusty, well watered, well watered. And there we go. Right, my carrots are watered. Now we just sort of leave it and wait. In the meantime, let's uh, clean ourselves, shall we? Wash all my clothes. We have unlimited water, so why not? I mean, some of this stuff. Did I? Do I still have some stuff from zombies? A few things from zombies. So might as well clean ourselves up. Helps prevent infection. Not that I probably have to worry about that. I'm probably still got a massive infection in my groin. I don't tell many people that. Okay. And now we wash ourselves. Now probably, I won't go back to that house today. I'll probably spend the rest of the day foraging. Trying to get that skill up. See if I can get anything decent. If I can just get some sticks, I can start building like, uh... Oh my god, look at me! And apart from the chest area, which is, like, destroyed still, but look at me. I'm looking perfectly fine. Okay. Uh, you know what? This can go in here. And so can the saucepan. 
Uh, the water bottle is mine. We'll put the trowel here. The beer. Yeah, let's... Okay, let's drink the rest of that. We'll keep the worm on us as an emergency food source. I can't really cook a worm, so I don't want to eat it. Whereas cockroaches, apparently I can. Okay, so... Let's go into forging mode. <clears throat> uh, won't search for anything in particular. So if I crouch and, like, focus... Let's see if I can find anything. I'm extremely tired, so this isn't gonna help. In fact, I might just end the day at this rate. Oh, I found... A stick! Amazing! I will take that! I got two branches. Alright, so I will slowly level up my forging skill. I need 75 for the next level so I can get more stuff. Now, if I can get a rock, like a sharpened rock, I can probably start making spears. If not, twigs will do fine. I can use that as kindling for the eventual fire I will make. I just gotta search around. <laughs> it would be nice if I had a book on forging. It would make this so much faster. But I don't. I don't have much of any literature, and I don't plan on getting much of any literature. Oh, there is a bush of unknown berries. <laughs> I have no idea if these are poisonous or not. Holly berries. I am not going to risk putting that in my mouth. It'll, it, it's just really nice to have. 